Take you around and show you inside. So the room we're going to feature is over there. Let's give you a look here. And then here's the big swimming pool area. Key card activation on the door. Take you around and show you inside. So we'll come back to the um, living room, dining room area after. We'll start in here. Vegetables, sauces. And then here's the name, Discovery Shopping Mall. By the bar. Uh, ooh, la, la. Inside, we have a huge screen TV. Place called El Dente, Italian and lounge. It's inside as well. Many drink sellers all at the back of the beach. Good afternoon from Bali, Indonesia. So today I'm here in the Kuta area, Bali. I'm on Jalankartika Plaza. And what I'm going to feature in today's video for you is an accommodation called Adi Jaya Hotel. So the Adi Jaya Hotel has an absolutely fabulous location here on Jalankartika Plaza. You're directly across the street from Discovery Shopping Mall. On the street of Jalankartika Plaza itself, you've got, uh, got a great collection of restaurant, warung, shop and bar options available to you. You're also not too far away from another mall called Lippo Mall in this area. You've got two great beach choices in this area also. There's uh, Pantai German or German Beach and also the popular tourist Beach of Kuta Beach, making this an ideal accommodation choice for your stay here in Kuta, Bali. So what I'm going to start off by doing is I'm going to take you inside Adi Jaya, give you a room and facility tour. After I've finished inside the hotel, I'm going to head out onto the street of Jalankartika Plaza and give you an idea and show you what restaurant, warung and shop options are available on the street there. And at the end of the video, I'm going to take you to Kuta Beach. So without any further ado, let's go and get started and share with you Adi Jaya Hotel. So here's the name of the hotel, Abhi Jaya Hotel. Jalankartika Plaza, this is Discovery Mall across the street there. Great location. Abhi Jaya also on the opposite side. Nice area for parking also, you're using car or motorbike. So we have a security desk in the side there. So we have motorbike parking to the left here. Car parking all around. And then here's the main entrance to Adi Jaya. Here's the reception desk. Good morning. Reception desk straight ahead there. Some guests waiting to check out with the suitcases and luggage stories. To the left here we have a seating area, also a water fountain. The main lobby lounge area here. There's a meeting room. Back inside there. And then just through the um, entrance here is a main swimming pool area. See, you have seating by the side of the poolside bar there. Some steps leading down into the pool in the middle, and then just to the back there, we have some sun lounges and umbrellas. Okay, so here's an angle on a swimming pool area. All the rooms, these are the deluxe pool access and pool view rooms in the back there. And I'm just turning around in the back here, this is a massage. Soccer uh, Bali Spa. Here's our massage tables. Okay, so just on the opposite side of the pool, this is the reception desk in the back there. Just here we have a small shallow pool suitable for the kiddies. Very shallow this one. Nice collection of sun lounges at the back here.
Okay, so this is a reception desk area in the back here. Here's a swimming pool. Now we're going to take you to our rooms. We're just going to give you a layout. So these are superior and deluxe rooms in the side here. Just all around. These are premier rooms overlooking the swimming pool area. Hello. And then we're going to take you through to the um, rooms in the back here which have a garden view. room we're going to feature is over there. Let's give you a look here. Side, one in the back also here. Temple in the middle. These are rooms 321, 322. Water fountain here. And this is the room we're going to feature. Okay, so this is a view of the Adi Jaya um, guard, Premier Garden View rooms from the front here. We have two um, in the building combined. There's a garden view. This room is occupied, that's 323. And then here's a room 324. So just on the balcony here we have two wooden chairs, wooden table. It's key card activation, the door. This room is 324. Provide you with umbrellas just in case it rains here in Bali. And light switches on the wall here. I'll take you around and show you inside. Okay, so just as we step foot inside the room, we're greeted by twin beds. The room next door is a king size bed, so this is suitable if you're traveling with a family. Immaculate presentation on the beds there. Just by the side of the bed, we have bedside cabinets. Just start at the right here, so that's the door connecting next door. There's a king size bed in that room if you're traveling as friends or family. We have a um, soft cushion seated chair here with stool. Just to the side of the bed, here's a close up on your bedside cabinet. Have a phone, TV, remote control, bedside lighting behind the bed there. Bedside cabinet on the opposite side of the bed. Nice decoration in the back there, in the wall, embedded in the wall. And there's another angle on your bed. Okay, so just opposite the beds, we have a huge flat screen LED TV, international channels provided, Wi-Fi also provided. Just up above there is our air conditioning, the bathroom in the distance. Just down below here, we have an area for our suitcases, electric power point to the side there. It's a close up on our LG flat screen TV, cabinet underneath. Okay, so just on the opposite side of the TV, we have a desk stroke dressing table area. A huge mirror there with that nice guy in. It's a veneer desk. We have an empty cabinet here. Start from right to left. We have a PowerPoint on the side here. We have a menu, some information, soft cushion seating. Another electric multi-socket point on the side here. Okay, so just working around from a desk area, we have a waste basket in the base there, and then just in the back here, we have a wardrobe. So we'll start from left to right, we have a mini refrigerator in the base there, shelf here, just up above, we have a um, electric power point, mini kettle, tea, coffee, sugar provided, some cups, glasses, acker in the back there, glass shelf here. And then just next door we have a wardrobe, so we open the door, the light comes on, shelving in the top, metal rail, wooden hangers, just in the base here we have a safety deposit box, also supplied with a mosquito repeller, in the base here we provide you with some slippers, laundry bag. Okay, so just moving on from a wardrobe, next is a door into the bathroom, so I have a wooden door, just 
just as we step foot inside the bathroom, we're greeted by a huge wooden frame mirror. There's a wash basin down below. Start from left to right, so just on the wall here, we provide you with a hairdryer. Have a collection of amenities here. Clean wash basin, provided with some hand soap there. Some shelving underneath. Just opposite a wash basin, we have a toilet also provided with bum wash. Have a waste basket in the base there, the toilet roll holder, have a bottle opener on the wall, and then just turning around, there's a mirror look going back into a bedroom. We have a bathtub, immaculately clean bathtub, have a handheld shower up above, shower curtain. Provide you with some um, bath um, foam and shampoo on the side there. We're able to help you get out of the bath. And then just at the back of the bathtub, we have a towel rail wrap with towels on. Okay, so this is a Premier Pool access room here at Adijaya. These are Premier Pool view rooms up above here. In the corner here, these are two family pool access and family pool view rooms in the corner there. I'll go all around to the side. Also have six here, pool access up above, pool, uh, pool access below, pool view up above. Here's a swimming pool. Okay, so we'll take you around and show you inside. So just outside the room, we have a balcony area here, just in the shade. We have two wooden chairs, wooden uh, coffee table, huge window, supplied with two um, umbrellas in case it rains here in Bali. This is room 0105, key card activation. Take you around and show you inside. Okay, so just as we step foot inside, we're greeted by a king size bed. I have a seating area at the base of the bed here, immaculate presentation on the bed, cabinets either side of the bed, bedside lighting either side of the bed. We'll start from right to left. I have a soft cushion seating chair here in the corner. There's a close up on a bedside cabinet. Also provide you with a phone, two power points in the back there. There's a bedside lighting. Also have bedside lighting behind the bed, beautiful um, material um, covering behind the bed also. There's a close up on your bedside cabinet on the opposite side of the bed. Have two sockets, multi socket on the side there and a standard Indonesian socket or your switches. A close up on your lighting on the opposite side of the bed. Close up on your pillows, immaculate presentation. And there's another angle on your bed. Okay, so just opposite the bed, we have an LG flat screen LED TV, international channels provided, Wi-Fi also provided. Just up above there is our air conditioning. We'll start from left to right. So just down in the base here, we have a waste basket. We have a desk stroke dressing table area here. Nice soft um, cushion seated chair. Beautiful um, mirror, wooden frame mirror. Just in the side there we have some power points, international and Indonesian. Just here we have a uh, provided with a kettle, um, water, glasses, cups, tea, coffee, sugar also provided. There's a close up on our LG TV. Just coming back down to the bottom now. Just in here we have a mini refrigerator. Cabinet underneath the TV also. And then just in the corner here, we have an area for our suitcases. There's a full view on your room. I will take you into the bathroom. So it's a sliding door here leading into the bathroom. Just as we step foot inside the bathroom, we're greeted by a nice, beautiful uh, bathtub. Beautiful decoration on the wall in the back there. Lighting up above. Immaculately clean bathtub. Just turning back to this direction, we have some mirrors uh, with a wardrobe doors. Just to right is our wash basin. So we're 
just opening the doors, we have a, a shelf in the top there, metal rail, collection of wooden hangers. Just in the base we provide you with some slippers. So moving back to the top, more shelving in the top there. So provide you with a safety deposit box, mosquito repeller, laundry bag if you're having your laundry done here at the hotel. Just next door to our wardrobe we have a uh, wash basin. So just as we um, set foot there's a huge mirror lighting up above there. Just on the wall on the right hand side we have a hairdryer, electric power point, one for the hairdryer, one underneath for a multi socket, hand soap in the back there, immaculately clean uh, wash basin, some shelving underneath, provide you with a collection of amenities on the shelf underneath. Okay, so just turning around from a wardrobe and a wash basin in the back here we have an enclosed glass shower cubicle and a toilet. And just down to the side here we have a waste basket, there's a toilet in the back there. Just up above we're provided with a metal rail and some towels. And then just next to that we have an enclosed glass shower cubicle. So as we step foot inside the glass shower cubicle we have a power shower on the wall up above there. Also provide you with a handheld shower, total fixtures and fittings. Have some um, shower gel and shampoo on the side here. Immaculately clean in the base there. Okay, so this is a superior room here at the Adi J Akuta. This is room 216. There's a corridor this way leading down the stairs there. There's a room number, keycard activation, take you around and show you inside. Okay, so just three step foot inside the room, we're greeted by twin beds. This room is also available in a double bed option. Uh, just in the middle of the beds, we have a bedside cabinet, some decoration above the beds. We'll start from left to right. So just in the corner here, we have a uh, soft cushion seat close up on the beds, immaculately clean, great presentation. Just go into the middle of the beds now, as your bedside cabinet, multi-socket power point on there, light switches also, there's a telephone, aircon TV remote, some information there, there's a close up on your decoration behind the beds, there's your other bed, another angle on your beds, Okay, so now I'm stood directly in between the beds and directly opposite the beds is a flat screen TV, international channels provided, Wi-Fi also provided. We have a cabinet underneath that houses a refrigerator. Just to the right there, we have a desk stroke dressing table area. We'll start from left to right. We'll start up here. There's our air conditioning mounted on the um, entrance to the room. Just here we have an area for our suitcases. Just here we have a cabinet. Just in the base there we have a refrigerator, some shelving space on that side. Just coming back up here we have a wooden tray, kettle, tea, coffee, sugar, cups, glasses in the back there, two bottles of aqua. There's a TV, LG flat screen TV. Just moving back down here we have two uh, power points on the wall here. There's a close up on our desk stroke dressing table area, soft uh, cushion chair, circular mirror. Have a menu here, some information. Okay, so just from our beds now, there's the door that we entered the room. Just to the left here is a uh, double wardrobe and um, wooden doors with a glass um, insert. So just in the top there, we have a metal rail, a little bit dark in here. Have a safety deposit box here. Mosquito repeller provided also. Just in the other side, the wardrobe, continuation metal rail, nice collection of wooden coat hangers. So just by the side of a wardrobe, we have a door here. This is a connecting room. So this room's two single beds. This is a superior room with a double bed, suitable for if you're traveling as friends or family. And then just opposite a connecting room and a wardrobe is our entrance to a bathroom. 
So just as we step foot inside the bathroom, turning back to the right, there's a wash basin, huge wooden frame mirror, great lighting in here. It's a close up on the wash basin, clean. Some amenities provided on the wooden tray there. Just moving back to this side, we have a hairdryer on the wall there, bottle opener, some hand soap. Just turning around from a wash basin, just down in the base there, we have a waste basket. Just over in the corner here, we have a toilet, also comes with bum wash. Just up above the ta uh, toilet, we have a metal towel rack rail, vent up above. And then just here we have an enclosed glass shower cubicle. Overhead rain shower and the uh, shower. Shampoo, bath, uh, shower gel provided. So this room also comes with balcony, so we have a big window, plenty of light beaming into the room, wooden door, key to open. Here's a balcony, good sized balcony, two wooden chairs, wooden coffee table. Good size here. And then there's a view down below straight into the swimming pool. Okay, so right in the corner here at the Adi J Akuta, this is a family suite room, pool access. This is room 106. The pool's just right there in the middle. So we have a big balcony in front of the room here, we'll start here, we have two wooden chairs, wooden coffee table, some umbrellas provided in case it rains in Bali in the corner there, nice big window into the room, there's the room number 106, key card activation on the door, we'll take it around and show you inside, so we'll come back to the um, living room, dining room area after, we'll start in here. So just we step foot inside the room, we're greeted by a, I think it's a queen size bed this, bedside cabinets either side, bedside lighting either side, have a seating area here at the foot of the bed, however we'll start from left to right, so we have a soft um, seating cushion uh, chair here in the corner, a big mirror behind the chair there, it's a close up on a bedside cabinet, also provided with a phone, two power points in the back there, there's a close up on your bedside lighting, material headboard um, behind the bed, also a wooden veneer finish headboard behind the bed, immaculate presentation and clean bedding. There's a cabinet on the opposite side of the bed, twin power points on this side of the bed also, aircon and TV remote as your light in, on this side of the bed. Another angle on your bed. So just opposite a bed, we have a flat screen TV, international channels provided, Wi-Fi also provided. We have a cabinet underneath the TV. We also to the left have a desk stroke dressing table area. Just up above there is our air conditioning. So we'll start here, just down below there is a waste basket. We have a veneer finished cabinet. There's no refrigerator in this one because it's in the kitchen. We have a LG flat screen TV, large TV, we have a menu for the restaurant, some information on the back there, some more information there. Just here we have a desk stroke dressing table area, huge mi uh, mirror, soft cushion chair, multi socket power points available. just from a TV and desk area we have a bathroom this bathroom does close off we have a sliding door here so just as we step foot inside the bathroom we're greeted by a beautiful um, bath some nice decoration on the back wall there nice deep bath very clean and just turning around in the corner there we have a toilet we have a waste basket down below a metal towel rail up above the toilet, extractor fan in the top there, and then just to the side there we have a glass and show, enclosed shower cubicle. So we just we step foot inside the shower cubicle, have a power shower up above, handheld shower on the wall there. Just to the side there we have a shelf with shampoo and shower gel, cleaning the base. 
and just from a shower turning to this side we have a wash basin and double wardrobe so we'll start from left to right with a wash basin so just on the wall here we have a hair dryer multi socket power point on the side there very clean wash basin with a full view of a mirror cabinet down below some amenities provided and just next door we have a um, double wardrobe with a, uh, two glass doors or two mirror doors so just inside the wardrobe there we have two shelves in the top there we'll start on this side we have a safety deposit box mosquito repeller provided collection of shelving some slippers in the base there and then just on the opposite side we have a shelving in the top metal rail wooden hangers Just from my parents' room now, we're going to head through into the um, kids' room. We'll come back to the kitchen and dining room area after. Well, this door leads into the kids' room. So just through here, we have twin beds, bedside cabinets either side, bedside lighting either side. Same presentation with the headboard behind the bed as the parents' room. We'll start from left to right. We have a soft cushion seating chair here in the corner. Just here we have a corner cabinet, um, bedside cabinet, phone, power point, close up on your bedside lamp, close up on your bedding, immaculately clean. So we have a door and a window there. There's a bedside cabinet on the opposite side, multi socket power points available on the wall there. There's your bedside lighting on this side another angle on your beds so just opposite of beds all along the back wall there just right in the middle we have a foot large flat screen TV with a cabinet below desk stroke dressing table to the left on the right here we have a double wardrobe with uh, mirrors we'll start from left to right so here's a desk soft cushion chair waste basket in the base there a huge mirror on the wall in the back there we have some multi socket power points LG flat screen TV huge that is cabinet in the base there and then just coming back to the doors we came in the room we have a double wardrobe with the uh, mirror doors so just on this side here we have some shelving safety deposit box some slippers in the base there just on the opposite side we have a shelf in the top there this one's lit in this side metal rail some wooden hangers so just from a bed turning back in this direction that's our entrance to a bathroom our air conditioning is up above there so just we step foot inside the bathroom the first thing that hits us is a wash basin absolutely huge uh, mirror on the wall there so wash basin down below, we'll start in the base, collection of amenities available there, toilet paper in the opposite side, just on the wall here we have a hair dryer, multi socket power point on the side, so close up on your mirror, immaculately clean wash basin, clean surfaces, and then just turning around as soon as we walk in on the right is a toilet also a waste basket there in the base some nice decoration on the wall there and then just up above the toilet we have a metal towel rack rail and then just here we have a glass enclosed shower cubicle inside the glass shower cubicle we have a power shower and held shower on the wall there some shampoo and body wash provided cleaning the base and this room's also got a door leading out into a little garden setting just a little corner garden here some plants we have a couple of wooden chairs and a wooden coffee table Ooh, sunlight comes in here Okay, so we've covered a parent's room, we've covered a kid's room in the back there. Now this is the kitchen dining room area. So there's also air conditioning in here. We have some picture decoration on the wall, one there, one under the air conditioning. 
We have a sports seater um, table and chairs. It's a veneer finished table, uh, soft cushion chairs. And then just over in the back here, we have a kitchen area. So we're providing with a microwave oven. Just in this cabinet here, we have a collection of plates and cutlery provided. Just from a cabinet there, we have some more cabinets up above. Also provided with some cups, some glasses in the back there also. And then just down below here, we have a wooden tray, tea, coffee, sugar, sugar kettle, four bottles of aqua, multi-socket power points in the back there. There's a sink. Everything's immaculately clean. And then just in the uh, corner here, we have a ref uh, fridge freezer. Okay, so this is room 105, the pool access room, which I've just shown you. The swimming pool's just behind the um, bushes here. And then now we're going to take you into the restaurant area. There's the restaurant dining facility area where you're going to be served your breakfast. There's some information on the wall here. And just down to the side here, we have a man creating some Hello. wood carvings. Hello, good morning. How are you today? Good, thank you. Good. It's all for sale. Some picture paintings uh, on the wall here. And these are what you're going to see everywhere in Bali, available from the hotel. And here's our um, check in desk just entering the uh, restaurant area. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, hello, good morning. And this is your breakfast display area, buffet breakfast. Okay, so first of all, just on the right hand side here, this is our egg station, so you can have any eggs made by the lady here in the back. Also have some noodles available, chilli sauce, tomato sauce, have some honey, some pancakes in here. Nice collection of fruits available here for all of those healthy eating options. What that is, we have some cakes in the back here also, a collection of jams and uh, margarine butter, a collection of brown and white bread. And around here we have another collection of uh, vegetables, sauces. Roasted potato, potato and nasi goreng. Sausage, chicken, mushroom, crackers, a nice collection of condiments also available. So just out over from the opposite side from all of our um, toast and fruit, provided with some coffee and tea also. Some cereal, milk available, some glasses, all the juices, some orange juice here, which is empty, I guess much like that one. We're also provided with some iced tea, infused water, and just some natural mineral water. Okay, so just from our breakfast buffet area, this is into the restaurant here. I'm not going to go too much inside because this is where all the people are eating. Just give you a view of the bar here. And then the restaurant area here, this leads out right opposite Discovery Mall across the street there. You are now on Jalan Kartika Plaza. 
Okay, so now I've finished my room and facility tour here at the Adi Jaya. I'm going to head out onto Jalan Kartiga Plaza and show you what restaurant or wrong shop and bar options are available. After that, I'm going to take you and show you Kuta Beach. Okay, so here's the Adi Jaya Hotel in the back there. There's the Adi Jaya Hotel sign. And then just directly across the street, this is Discovery Shopping Mall. Okay, so now I'm across the street from the Adi Jaya Hotel driveway. We have a thicker field of rubber. We have a Mini Mart convenience store across the street there. If you need any snacks, cigarettes, etc. And then just from a Mini Mart round the corner here, we have the steps leading up to Discovery Shopping Mall. I'll just show you downstairs first. Marks and Spencers here. This is a Sogo, this is a department store. And then here's the name Discovery Shopping Mall. Okay, so just from the Discovery Shopping Mall sign, we'll take you up the stairs now. This is normally busy here over the weekend, they have live performances in this area here. This is the main entrance into Discovery Shopping Mall there. And then just here we have a Burger King. And then just on the opposite side we have five monkeys, fresh burgers and hot dogs. And then just here in the back is another entrance into Discovery Shopping Mall. Okay, so just back at a main entrance area, just next along the line here, we have a subway. This is new in Bali. It's the name of the both subway. And then just next door, we have a Starbucks coffee shop. Green shop called Palatas Way. Oh, they are delicious, full of fruit. And then just to the side here, we have a Starbucks coffee shop seating area. And then here, I think this is called Big Papas. Okay, just back down at a Discovery Shopping Mall sign now after a venture up into the top there. Now we're back on Kartika Plaza. So directly across the street here, this is Beres Mera. This is Sadi Jaya's own um, restaurant we've already featured in the video. Just next door we have a place called Warung Telegas. That's the name up above. Take you around and show you inside. So you can seat in here by the roadside. So just as we step foot inside, we have a nice collection of wooden tables and chairs, very bright sunlight, beautiful lighting up above, air conditioned in here. There's a name on the wall there. And then we have seating all the way through into the back there. So I'm just on the opposite side of the street from Wong Rorong Telegas. 
next we have a place called Spice Mantra, it's an inspirational Indian cuisine. There's the name. So we look at some of the dishes available here, tandoori lobster. We're going to take you around and show you inside. Chef special. Just from Spice Mantra, inspirational Indian cuisine, next we have Bamboo Bar and Grill. So we have sports available here, AFL. Take you around and show you inside. Flat screen TVs up above there, beautiful seating area here. Just here we have Bamboo Bar and Grill and then next door we have Water Bomb Bali which is the water park. So just from Water Bomb now we're going to continue walking up the street here and then our next place on the side here is a place called Wurrungamar. So here's, here's the menu here at Wurrungamar, the Indonesian menu. Side. Nice collection of seating here in the courtyard. Some seating also on this side. I'm just going to take it around and show you inside. Beautiful seating area to the right, also uh, to the left, also to the right. There's a counter bar area in the middle here. And then just to the side we have a beautiful collection of tables and chairs, some nice paintings on the wall. And exactly the same on this side. So we're just coming out of Warung de Mar now, we're just going straight next door. And now we have a place called Club Havana.
so just from Club Havana right across the street there we have a huge collection of ATM machines and money changer on the corner there and then a big collection of money ATM machines okay so here's our ATM machines and then next in line we have Bubba Gump Shrimp Co there's a close up on Bubba, Dr uh, Bubba Gump Shrimp Great fun, great party. It's the entrance now. TV screens all around, nice collection of tables and chairs. Nice food seating here. Just at the back there is a bar. Hello! Just across the street from Bubba Gump Shrimp and Co. Next to the line we have a place called Car Bar. So just from our inside of the uh, car bar and grill, just next door we have a place called Coffee and Hue. So just next door to Coffee and Hue we have a place called Temple by Ginger Moon. So here's the entrance now and here's the name up above, Temple by Ginger Moon. Beautiful seating area in here. Okay, so here's Temple by Ginger Moon, just in the distance there. And then now just on the opposite side of the street, we have a place called Dolce Vita, Italian restaurant and pizzeria. It's the name of the book again. A nice collection of authentic Italian tables and chairs inside here. It's also to the right. Take you inside. It's air conditioned inside here. And we'll just have a nice seating area inside with a continuation. There's a bar at the back. So just on the opposite side of the street from Dolce Vita Italian, we have a place called Wake Barley Art Market. And also have your fish bar here. And then inside is a huge collection of tourist goods. Just from Wake Barley Art Market, there's Dolce Vita Italian across the street, Kimberley Spa, and then here we have Wong Kitchen. So Kimberley Spa in the back there, this is called Wong Kitchen. There's some of the menu here. Tables and 
chairs all around. And then just in the back there we have a beautiful seating area. Ooh la la, will you look at that? Wow. Just from one kitchen here, we have a Chinese restaurant, it's called Blue Lobster Restaurant. So we're just on the opposite side of the road now, Blue Lobster Restaurant. All the fresh seafood here. And then here's the guy cooking the lobsters there. The sort of shrimps, remember. So this is the Blue Lobster restaurant here and then just next door we have an Alpha Mart. Okay so here's our Alpha Mart in the distance and then just on the opposite side of the street we have a place called Matilda Sports Bar. There's a collection of seating here, closer up look at the name. Also some seating on the opposite side there, and then here's the main entrance. So just we step foot inside, we have a huge screen TVs on the walls there, a nice collection of tables and chairs, so some to the right as well. And then just in the back we have a huge, huge bar. Right Matilda, it's all happening here. Just from Matilda's, we're going to continue walking up the street here. So just up the street from Matilda's on this side, around about 40-50 uh, metres, we have a place called Sea House. Okay, so we have Sea House across the street, we have Bluefin, Japanese fusion restaurant, and then just on this side of the street we have a place called Welcome to Bee Couple. Nice seating area here by the roadside and a huge seating area inside. So we have Sea House, Blue Fin, Japanese Fusion. Here's the end of B Couple. There's the seating areas here. And then just at the end of um, B Couple, we would have a place called Rangma Hall Tandori Kitchen. Just from B Couple, we have a brand new place called El Dente, Italian and Lounge. It's the name up above. Just have permission to take you around and show you inside. So just to the left there is a main bar counter area. Nice collection of seating available. Some nice seating on the opposite side also. Something great coming soon there for Pito Supermarket in the back. And then just inside a beautiful collection of um, tables and chairs. So just next door to Al Dente we have a place called Stadium Sport Stadium Cap and Sports Bar. 
and then just in the back here a place called Warung Kuta this is like a handicrafts gifts and souvenirs huge shopping place all in the back there Just from the wrong feature in the back, there's a stadium cap sports bar. And directly across the street, we have Flapjacks Barley. Here's the name of the both Flapjacks. We're open for breakfast, 8 a.m. Just from Flapjacks now, we're going to head here. So now we've arrived at the Coots, the new Cooter Art Market. Here we are, Passar Sene Cooter. This is going to be to Cooter Square this way. This is Jalan Bakulsari up there. And there's Kuta Art Market. So just from Kartika Plaza Street is a um, art market now, the big Kuta Art Market. It's where you enter to get into all the shops. Also some tourist goods shops on the opposite side as well. And then this is going to be Kuta Beach. Walking through the gates now. Big statue up above there, like that. So we're just going to be coming to sunset. Some little restaurant or rooms at the back of the beach there. It's about a car parking area here. drink cellars all at the back of the beach the seating area here plastic chairs and umbrellas that's the main area of Kuta Beach over in the distance it's quite busy here also there we are at the water's edge and from right to left just coming to sunset 